Hello, my fellow veterans, and welcome to Veterans Advice Hub. My name is Bill Kelly, and today I want to talk to you about uh, a question that I get an awful lot uh, seemingly lately, uh, and that is, can I work or can I not work with a VA disability of 100%? So the answer is it depends, because there are two different types of 100% disability rating. One is based on your actual VA disabilities, and the application of what we refer to as VA math. There's a separate video on, on how they do the calculations, but that is the you know 10% for tinnitus, 10% for uh, you know arthritis in my knee, 20% for this item, 50% for sleep apnea, whatever you know ailments you have, whatever issues you have, 70% percent for uh, PTSD, whatever you're rated at, right? When you do the VA math, you get an overall um, VA disability rating. If that is 100%, you can work because that is based on the rating schedule. So that's called a scheduler rating. That's, that's just the, the VA math application of the combined total of all your different VA disability ratings. On the other hand, if you have a VA disability rating um, that is not 100%, but you qualify for individual unemployability and you're increased to 100% or paid at the 100% level because of that program, because you're eligible for that very specific individual unemployability program, then you are limited in your ability to work and you cannot um, make an income above the poverty level, which gets adjusted every year by HUD. Um, and in 2021, the single person uh, poverty level is $12,880 for, for two people. So say it's an older couple uh, uh, living on a fixed income, it's uh, $17,420 uh, a year. That's an annual income. So, you know, basically very, very little income. So VA disability scheduler rating based on your combined VA disabilities, even if you hit a hundred percent permanent and total, you can still work. They're, they're not connected to each other. Um, if you are at 100% because you qualify for individual unemployability, I mean, unemployability is in the word, means you cannot work and claim the, uh, the 100% benefit. Uh, when I say you can't work, you can't work and earn an income above the poverty number, uh, which gets adjusted each year. So what happens if you have unemployability and you do decide to work? Well, um, if you end up paying taxes on that money, uh, like a, a, a normal above board, I'm not talking about anything you do on the side, that's your business. But, you know, basically, if you have a salary, you're going to get taxed on it. And the IRS and the VA do talk to each other. If your name uh, comes up and your Social Security comes up with an income above that level, they are going to uh, look at your eligibility for individual unemployability. So what happens if they take it away? Well, then you drop down from 100% to whatever your combined total rating would be, whether that's you know 70%, 80%, 90%, whatever whatever it would have been, that's what you get paid for. So you don't lose the ratings. You just don't get paid at 100% because by definition, if you're making more than above the poverty level, you're not eligible for individual unemployability. So to summarize, there's two different types of 100% permanent and total rating. If it's a scheduler rating, you can work. If it's an unemployability uh, adjusted to 100% because of that program, you cannot work above uh, and make more money above the poverty level uh, as stated by HUD each year. So I hope that clears up the questions. Uh, feel free to post any comments and I'll do my best to uh, answer your specific question. And, um, and that's it. Have a great day. Thank you for your service. Bye.